Hello horror fans, and welcome back to Dead by Daylight. In this episode, we're continuing with the Midnight Grove challenges. I decided to switch off of the one from Michaela Reed surviving because I've been just struggling with that a bit. And instead, I'm going to go with one here where I have to unlock two chests. Alright, so I've got two chests here, they're good enough for me. All I need to do is get both these chests taken care of. So I'm going to go downstairs, get this chest first, because I really don't want to be in the basement any longer than I have to. Facing a doctor here, he's going to make a scream whenever he does his shock again. So definitely want to be out of here as soon as possible. Hey, found a key. Doesn't really do that much for me. Alright. Out of the basement. Let's unlock this chest and we'll have achieved our challenge already here. Then we can go about playing the game. I'd rather have the med kit. Okay, somebody disconnected. That's not great. Alright, that person already got a generator done, which is a good thing. I'm going to try for the rescue here. Yeah, I'm going for you. We'll use this med kit to heal you up. Okay, doctors are turning over here. Not the greatest. Alright, we got hit. That's fine. I did get the safe hook rescue. Oh, great. He's after the fang, who's right behind me. Not the greatest thing. It's a flashlight. Don't need that. I'm going to work on this. See what I can do for the team a little, a little bit here, at least. Get some added points. Oh, he's got Hex Ruin, too. Good to know. You know what? I'm going to go look for that. Because it's not like we're going to survive, so I might as well get the points that I can. I mean, having the survivor that disconnected right away on us really ruins the game for everybody. The killer and the survivors. So, it's really unfortunate. Some people just uh, are a bit childish, don't know how to play a game with others. So... Since the DC penalties have been uh, disengaged, yeah, it's just been a bit rough overall, it seems. <laughs> Alright. I'm just looking around for a totem. See if I can find it anywhere. Alright, he's over there. Oh great, I got the hindered status effect. Not what I needed right now. But I will try to get over here and save her again. Hopefully the hindered status effect will uh, not stop me from doing that. I'm coming as quickly as I can here, Fang. Go ahead and run. I am not healing you under the hook. If you want to run over here, that's fine. I will heal you. Ah! 
You're not. Oh, you are healed. Alright, never mind. Alright, let's get this heal. And then we will go ahead and try to go get this safe. Don't follow right with me, Fang. That's not a good thing. Okay. Okay, he's after me. That's fine. Hopefully the Fang will go get the save then. I'm gonna head over in this direction. I do have Iron Will, which makes it a bit easier for me being injured than other people. Okay, that was not a great save there. Okay, he just wants to end the game. You know what? That's fine. And the guy had unbreakable. All right. Well then. It's been a really fun game. <laughs> but we did achieve our challenge at least, so you know what? I guess that's good enough. He's going to just crouch over there, and is he going to come save me? Thank you. You got to come save me. And he's not going to. All right, then. Well, great job on his part there. Oh, well. We'll try to escape. Why not? Yep, we didn't escape. As I said, the one baby that disconnected at the beginning there really made the game unfun for everybody else. I really think that they need the DC penalty back because we need to get people like that out of the game. And with that, we'll go ahead and claim the last place you look. I'm going to go ahead and end this video here. If you enjoyed the video, please go ahead and click the like button. If you've not already, please subscribe to the channel and click the bell icon so that you're aware when I produce new videos in the future. Thank you, and hope to see you all again in the fog.